George the Third. Bow down to me. Are you calling me a tyrant? I managed 31 colonies. You tried that, you commoner. I became king in 1760 at age 22. Believe it or not, I was very close to my family. I married Princess Charlotte Mecklenburg. Oh, she was German, but I loved her. We had 15 kids. Some people may say that I taxed the colonists to become rich. That is not true. Even though I was king, I still lived in a modest house. Well, mansion. But it wasn't a palace. The colonists called me Mad King. They called me this because I had violent bilious attacks. I was already dealing with enough problems. London had a share of wealth that was filled with many poor people and thieves. Coal was also polluting London, making many people sick and the death rate high. Coal is not clean. You try to manage these problems. On top of that, I dealt with these American colonies. You see, there's this war. You may know it as the French and Indian War. Since I lost money from this war, I had to tax the colonists. I had to tax them for their own protection. What else did they want? Anyways, these ungrateful colonists rebelled. I had the strongest need in the whole world, and they somehow managed to beat it. That'd make anyone go mad. So I lost the 13 colonies. I still had 18 left. And that George Washington, I'm sick and tired of him getting all the credit. He can never face the challenges I had to when I was the king. I think I held these challenges pretty well. Do you think I did? Are you calling me tired of again? I was only trying to do the best of my colonists, and they were ungrateful for all the things I did for them. Fine, go ask their perspectives. Remember.